so today I'm gonna to be showing you guys what's in my bag. I feel like this is a thing that people do enjoy, looking at what people keep in their bags. And I feel like I always carry around a lot of stuff, so I'll let you guys in on everything, I guess. So first, this is my bag. Super cute. It's from my mom made it. I don't think they sell it anymore, so I'm sorry. It's like a quilted uh, floral print bag. I think it is the cutest thing ever. I originally went on my mom made it when I started like making good amount of money. <laughs> I bought myself for Christmas, I wanted to get like the puffer tote and this was on there and I was like, I need it. So I got it, um, I don't think they sell it anymore. If they do, I'll go look like when I post this video. Now, <laughs> I've been waiting for this little, so we'll start off with my actual bag, like what's on it, there's only this on it. But this jelly cat, I've been searching far and wide for and I didn't wanna have to order it off the that was weird. I didn't want to have to order it off the website because like shipping is like mm, a little expensive, but, um, and they were also out of stock. So I have a store near me that sells jelly cats. So like every time I'd be in the area, like I'd go check and like, it just never, never was there. So then I caved and I just went ahead and bought it offline when it came back in stock. She's so cute. I didn't, I wanted her to go specifically on this bag, but the keychain it doesn't fit around this loop so I just made I have like a huge lace basket so I just got um, one of my little things and I just put it on here and like triple knotted it and then put the bow and then put her on it so yeah so that's that simple cute this purse um, has like a little clasp like magnet and then it has like two pockets and a zipper which I like never put anything in here um, and those things, I don't know why. So in one of them, I have my keys, Honda. Uh, you know that song that's like, Riding down the street in my seat, RV, picking up my home. Anyways, um, I really want to bedazzle it. You think I can bedazzle it? I don't know. On my keys, there's my car key, my house key, this little random keychain that I made because I got keychain. I don't know if you'll be able to see this. Um, cause I got like these keychain things from Hobby Lobby and then I got a whole tea set and I didn't want all of them. So I just made a keychain out of it. This I got off Timu and it's a Lego piece, but it's a piece of a heart and Caleb has the other half. This I found a couple weeks ago. This is from my childhood. Um, found it in the garage in a random box and I thought, oh my gosh, this is so cute. So I put it on my keys. So we have that. I have to like organize my stuff into bags. So I have three different bags in here. So one, this is my big bag. Okay, cute, cute print. I got this off of TikTok shop. Then I have this bag that I actually made the other day, hold on. Look, so cute. I made it, it's got a cute little lace tail thing. But I made this and then we have this uh, bag which is also off of TikTok shop so we'll start with this bag the big one then I have, <laughs> I have more bags inside of it please don't judge okay so first I have this bag <laughs> this is my pad bag um, I think it is ripping a little I got it off Timu it fits three of my big pads Whenever I see people talk about their like period pads and they're like tiny, I'm like, do you guys not bleed? Cause like for me, like I don't wear tampons. Um, and after the information that just came out, I'm so happy that I've never liked tampons. I'm okay with the pads. The people that'll judge me be like, ew, that's like a diaper. Leave me alone. It's my blood. Anyways, but yeah, so three big pads fit in here but I just keep them in here. This keeps them from like, cause when I used to carry my pads around in my purse or my tote bag, like they would always like get opened and like they'd get like dirt in them just from like regular dirt, you know, like things just get dirty. And so then I'd be like, oh, I don't want to put that next to my, you know, girl. So yeah, now I have a little bag for it. 
Um, it also says a beautiful life begins with a beautiful mind. Next, I have this. So I got this pouch. <laughs> this is actually from Claire's. Um, I bought a bunch of like stuff for children, like a, look how cute though. Look how cute. Um, but I bought a bunch of stuff for a children's orphan orphanage. I didn't specifically buy it for that, but like when I worked at Claire's, we would have like $2 clearance and then it'd be a dollar for us. So I would buy up a bunch of things that I thought were really cute. And then ultimately I did find an orphanage to give it to. And yeah, so I kept this because I thought it was really cute. This is what my like cash and my change goes in though. So I don't really carry around cash, but I love change. Because when I go thrifting in the mountains or like yard sailing, ugh, it's like I'm not spending any money when I use like quarters and like dimes, like my change. When you use change, it's like, oh, I didn't spend any money. Nobody likes change anymore. I love change. I love change. Next, this is my uh, wallet. It's a little dirty. It's really beat up and dirty. Don't judge it, okay guys? I got this from PacSun, um, but they're little Sony Angels. And this was before I even knew that it was the Sony Angels that like I have. And then I connected and I was like, I don't really use my this wallet. That's why I don't really care that it's beat up because I don't ever use what's inside of it. But I have my license. I have my physical like credit card and regular card. I have my insurance card. I have my food line and BP. It literally doesn't work. Every time I enter my phone number, it doesn't work. Um, a good RX. I don't know. I just kept it. And then I have like these kitten around cat lounge scratch thingies. Um, and then my Starbucks gift card. But I use Apple Pay for everything. So like I rarely need to get these out. But it's good to just have them. So on you just in case like you know my license if I got pulled over or something. So then I have my taser. I love it. I'm going to do it real quick. Be prepared. It also has a light on it. Um, I got this when I started, after I dropped out, and <laughs> I started working at Kohl's. I was a working woman. I was like, okay, I need to protect myself. It was only $20 on Amazon at the time. I don't know how much it is now, but I will link it. I love it. Next, I have my little thing of ibuprofen. I also have allergy relief. I've only had to use allergy medicine. I think it was like last year. Or was it this year? I don't even know. There was one point where I had to use allergy medicine a lot. I have my inhaler. I have my Trader Joe's peppermints. These have like no food coloring in them, so they're great. And then I got these peppermints up in a place called, um, <gasps> no, I forgot it. What is it called? I forgot. Little Switzerland. And they're, look at, they're so cute, but they say pride and peppermints. It's not gonna focus. Oh my gosh. They say pride and peppermints. How cute is that? And then this is literally dead. Um, I got this for my birthday, um, not this year, but last year. <laughs> She's dead, guys. I need to revive her. So that's everything that's in this bag. Now we'll do this bag. So this is like my cosmetics bag. So I have my little travel size, um, Rio, wait, no, Sol J, Sol J Janeiro. I, I don't know how to say it. Sol Janeiro, Sol Jan, anyways, and 40. I have a hair bow. I have my lip liner. This is my lip combo. Uh, it's the L'Oreal Paris Color Rich Matte Lip Liner in 110 Matte Zip. And then this random gloss that I got from a, not a junk store, uh, a salvage shop. It's now torn down because we have a huge highway coming through where we live, um, which is so sad. I don't know where it went, but I remember I got this from there. And it's Laura Geller Color Luster Lip Gloss. I'll see if I can find it online because I'm running out, I'm running low. Then I have my Hello Kitty Handy Dandy Cream and Birthday Cake. It smells so good. And it's also rated really good on the Yuka app. So we love that. Then I have my two Glossier Balms. So I have the mint and strawberry ones. Then I have my just regular Glossier lip gloss. Then I have this Pure Instinct um, roll-on perfume. 
I like rarely. I don't know why. I rare. Why is it not focusing? Whatever. I rarely use this. Let's use it. What it's supposed to do? It's like a pheromone perfume, so you're supposed to like rub it, and it's supposed to like make your natural scent like more desirable or something. I don't know. I smell like an old grandma in my mind. Then I have my. I don't know how this is pronounced. Is it like K Alley or like Cali? Yeah, I don't know. But this is my little to go vanilla perfume. Then I just have a Burt's Bees and Vanilla Bean lip balm. And that's everything in that one. And now this bag. Now this is like my electronic bag and there's actually something missing and I don't know where I put it. So that's lovely. I have my Nikon. It's so funny because like digital, yeah, I need to remove all of these and redo it. Um, but it's so funny how like digital cameras like have become such a big thing. I remember when I got this, it was actually my mom. So this is like an OG one. Like she bought it back when it came out and she used to take pictures on it all the time. And anyway, she gave it to my brother. And then at some point it was like during, I think my it was like covid time and like or my no because i think mm, i think i did get it back so freshman year which was i went to college um 2019 so then 2020 i'm pretty sure that's when i ended up getting it or i started using it at least i can't remember i might have bought a um new battery for it i, I might have had it before then but yeah i think i like fully got it working in 2020 and then i started using it but yeah, I love it. The pictures, I always look so good on it. And I'm low key like trying to find ways to not use my phone as often. And like, I honestly hate when I take like photo shoots on my phone. So I love this or like my actual like photo shoots. Um, so yeah, um, this is like just such like a cute like, oh, you're on a road trip, boom. Oh, you're just out and about having fun, boom. I just love it it's so cute then i have the like adapter for the sd cards so like when i'm on the go i can like go ahead and upload the photos to my phone i don't know what this is these are in this little baggie i have like fisheye lenses for my phone i like never use them i got these i think in 2020 as well when i was quarantined can you actually wait a second would it like do it on here Oh my gosh, that's actually kind of cool. If I could only like figure out how to keep it on there. Like imagine I film a video like this. What's up guys? Okay, I have a micro like SD card converter. I don't know why I have that. I still don't know what this is to. This might be the thing that's to the thing that's missing. That might have sound me confusing. Usually I have a portable charger that goes in here, but I have no idea. I don't know what I did with this. Actually, I'm gonna put this in here. Usually I carry a charger, because I have two chargers for my camera, so I'm gonna put one back in here. I don't know where my portable charger went, but I usually have that in here. I just don't, I don't know where it went. So yeah, the world may never know. Then this is like rare if I put it in my purse, but if I know that I'm gonna be like, out for like maybe a little bit like i'll pack this just to like in case like i feel like drawing also i also will put anytime i go out i'll put my shopping list this is my little shopping list pad notepad this is also something i found in our garage and my mom was like giving me stuff that i can like sell at a yard sale and then sometimes like i'm like i like this so i take it so i liked this so i took it <laughs> So I've been writing my shopping list on here and honestly last time that I used it because I just recently Started using it. It was so it was like so fun I don't know why but it was so fun like grocery shopping Instead of like looking on my phone at the list and having to keep on locking my phone like I just had this Right here. It was so fun. I loved it. Okay, so anyways, here's my sketchbook. Sometimes like I will carry it around Here's all the cool stickers on it. I don't remember where I got this. Uh, I might not remember where a lot of them are from. Ego Trip. I don't remember. The, this one is Kitney. This one is Brandy. This is actually from something that I drew and I cut it out of the sticky paper and I put it on there. Same, no, I didn't draw that. I printed that out. That was when I was testing out my fairy tattoos. Um, this is Brandy, that's Brandy. 
another drawing of mine I just cut out. This is Olivia Rodrigo sticker. This is Brandy. And then this is from an artist that um, I'll link her below because she's so cool. But um, I bought some stuff from her and she included this sticker and I thought it was the cutest thing. Then on this side, this is from Kitney. This one I got either at like Hippie Fest or a market where they had a bunch of stickers for sale. I can't remember where. This one's from Brandy. This one's Kitney. This is Wildflower. This one was given to me by an old friend. Same with this one. This one is from something, uh, a bunch of stickers I got off Timu. And then this one is from, I don't even remember where I got this one from. Sorry guys. But obviously Sarah's totes. But I don't remember what tote bag or, I don't know. Um, but yeah, so my sketchbook, I rarely sketch. I'm really bad about it. Like, it's also, it's probably because this one page that I made, I just think that she's like an icon. And I just feel like I can't outdo that. But I love Tim Burton eyes. Like, those are so fun to draw. Just in case I get inspired when I'm out for the day, like I want to have it. So I will pack this with me. And then obviously I'll pack um, a pencil. I think that's everything. Yeah, that's pretty much everything. I love this bag. It's so cute. It is like big. So like when I wear it, it is like, it's a big bag, but I don't care. Like it has everything that I need in it. Oh, I usually have hand sanitizer too, but I ran out. But yeah, that was everything. I hope you guys enjoyed the what's in my bag. I love it. She's so cute. I love my little jelly cat on her. Like it's such a vibe, you know? I don't know how to make an outro. Like sometimes I forget how to like actually like do this low key. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up or don't. Uh, do whatever you please. If you have any other suggestions for any videos, let me know. It's not that I've been like not knowing like videos to do. I have a lot of video ideas. It's just that <laughs> getting the motivation to do it and then having the motivation to edit it afterwards is like key. And a lot of the videos that I want to do are more like lengthy than this. Like this, I'm gonna, I just sat down and I filmed the whole thing. But it'll be so easy to like edit this video versus one that's over the span of like days and like has more layers to it. So yeah, and I just like, Getting back into YouTube, I can't do that yet. Like, I gotta do small. I gotta do baby steps, y'all. So that's kind of like why I haven't put out a video in a hot minute. Because I was I was making two different videos. I deleted the first idea completely. And then the second one, I, I was like, scratch it, scratch it. If you have any ideas, let me know. If you have anything that you want to specifically see from me, you can also let me know about that. Um, if you have any other questions ask them in the comments. Other than that, have a beautiful day or night or whenever you're watching this and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!